It's Mabel, right? Yeah. Tommy? Oh, okay, I already did that bit. Uh, what was your name again? Shut up. Uh, yeah, hey. Then I took a year off to go travelling. Did you ever go back and finish? Mm, I always meant to, but well, I just couldn't face it. So here I am, almost 30 and still working in a bar. Oh, sounds like you did what you needed to do at the time. Do you regret it? I mean, travelling? All that experience. Experience won't pay a mortgage. True, yeah. I mean, my banker only accepts self-loathing, which is weird. That is weird. These photos that they took of the ultraviolet waves out in space, it's so... The first time I saw one, I genuinely... You're a nerd. <laughs> not a nerd. You are a massive nerd! I will not apologise for being emotionally available. Yeah, okay, I cry at photos of space is not emotionally available. That's like a two years into marriage story. These are not photos of space. That is the Carina Nebula, and you can put some respect on her goddamn name. I can't believe this isn't a turn-off for me. You deserve some negative reinforcement. It's, it's definitely not a turn-off for me. In photos from the James Webb Space Telescope are actually the only thing that get me going. While you're crying? It's a fucking roller coaster, man. <laughs> uh, you want to know something fucked up? More fucked up than cry wanking to the birth of stars. Absolutely. I haven't cried in two years. Huh. Some twisted part of my brain kind of feels like that's a challenge. Oh, sir. If you can make me cry, I will shake your hand. As long as I'm not crying at the same time, or else you know, there's probably a 50% chance of me being inappropriately erect. <laughs> so. Hey. Do you wanna? Hey, what do you wanna do now? Should we get another drink? I think we're about to get kicked out. <laughs> <laughs> <Touché>. <laughs> I actually think... I actually think it's okay sometimes. Like, I'd much rather be ghosted than... You know, the whole, like... Yeah, but I think you're great. Text. <laughs> yeah. I definitely prefer a digital ghosting than a real-life one. How do you ghost someone in real life? I woke up and she'd snuck out during the night. No. <laughs> Fully time traveler's wife did. People really do that? Yeah. That's fucked up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Shit. So what about you? Do you have any app horror stories? All right. I, um, I didn't want to see this one guy again. So he asked me to pay him back for the first date. Jesus. <laughs> that is grim. I know, right? How could I let a guy like that get away? So, I take it you're not much of a second date kind of person? Not really, no. Why not? I mean, doesn't it get lonely? I meet a lot of people. Yeah, but how well can you know someone if you just spend a night with them? I like to think of it as meeting humanity in the aggregate. I'm sure you are. All right then, Judgy. Why are you so obsessed with getting into a relationship? I don't know. Because it just makes life better. Says who? Everyone. Have you ever met a good one? I just haven't met the right person yet. Oh, come on. We don't have the right person. Everyone's fucked. Yeah, but I don't want to be fucked alone. Sorry. Sorry. Well, hey, if you don't want to talk about your sad feelings, you just want to bury it, then you should think about just casual sex. It's way more fun. Yeah. What are you trying to bury? Oh, look, I think your train is about to come. <laughs> well, you're going to be good as gravy. Mabel? You're all right. 
Yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna call an Uber. Uh, yeah, no problem. <laughs> My house, if you wanted to. Oh yeah, and stay on the couch. Sure. Not ready for anything new. But yeah, that's so fair enough. Sorry, I didn't mean to fuck you around or anything. I just. <sighs> it's fine. You know, I um I actually had a really nice night. 